Ohio University faculty from a wide range of fields are conducting research in nanoscience in an effort to build faster, more efficient technology. Ohio Univer University physicist Arthur Smith is leading the research and joins us in our studio tonight. Thanks, Arthur, uh, Mr. Smith, for joining us tonight. Good afternoon. Well, my first question is, what do <clears throat> atoms and molecules have to do with enhancing technology for the future? Uh, everything. Absolutely everything, because atoms and molecules make up all of the products and all of the everything that you see around you. As technology becomes increasingly more miniaturized, these same atoms and molecules become increasingly more important. Because as particles or objects become smaller and smaller, the surfaces as compared to the volume of the particles becomes more and more important. And that therefore means that the atoms themselves become more, playing a bigger role in the properties that, of these devices. Okay. And you use these atoms in your research, you use a tool called the nanospintronic device. Uh, what kinds of technology are you hoping to improve? Well, I personally work in the area of nanomagnetism, and this uh, technology is aimed towards increasing future device storage capacity, processing uh, of electronic, electronic processing speed and efficiency and power. That's uh, sort of the direction that my research is headed. I work in a more uh, sort of a more fundamental role, these applications are a little further down the road compared to what I do, but okay. nonetheless. And so you mentioned some things are further down the, the road. Have, you, have there been any inventions that, are, uh, that, that we've seen from this science already? Uh, well, certainly. Um, magnetoresistive devices are all around us. The, uh, the very uh, disk drive storage capacities that, that we have in today's technology uh, were not possible 10 years ago, and due to the advent of new magnetic device technologies which are definitely uh, taking advantage of nano magnetic properties. Uh, we today have uh, all of these high density memories and storage capacity which make possible our smartphones and our you know super fast computers and so on. Mm -hmm. uh, what kind of other things are other Ohio University researchers working on? Well, uh, at Ohio University we have a, within uh, the institute that I direct which is the Nanoscale and Quantum Phenomena Institute we have a wide-ranging uh, faculty covering everything from um, magnetic materials to electronic materials, nanoporous materials, chemical, uh, chemical materials which respond to light and heat. Uh, of course, on the engineering side, we have people working in, in engineering applications of uh, nano devices. We have uh, biochemists working to develop particulates which will aid in improving the behavior of the heart muscle and how the heart works. Uh, for example, the doc, Dr. Malinsky's uh, research. Okay. And, and will this, the future of this technology help in any other areas very quickly? Uh, certainly. Uh, many, many other areas. Our, our entire lives are pervaded by nanotechnology. Many of us don't realize uh, that nanotechnology is fundamental to our current lives. Uh, it's all around us. In, and there's a great wide open future for developing new technology which will solve many important problems that we face as, as a human, uh, uh, human beings. Right. Mr. Smith, thank you so much for joining us in our studio tonight.